Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I decided to do a hairstyling video for you guys and I decided to do some of my favorite ways to wear a beanie and also how to like style your hair when wearing a beanie. And the beanie I have today is this one right here. I got this one from H&M in Chicago. Wait, no, Chicago? Yeah. H&M when I was in Chicago uh, beginning of last year. And yeah, this is a really great beanie. And this is the beanie that I'm gonna use today to style and style my, yeah, style my hair. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoy the video and let's just get right into it. Usually, I'm not gonna lie, usually I just put it on top of my hair like this. Even if it's a little straight, like today it's just a little wavy, it's just my natural hair. And uh, I will usually just wear it like this and just pull my hair back just slightly and put it on like this. Sometimes I will take some of this hair out and leave one open like so. These are just extra ones. Um, I just wanted to share with you guys different ways to wear it and this is usually how I would wear mine most of the time. Sometimes I do want to create little cute little hairstyles just to give this look more substance, I guess you can say. So anyway, although I really enjoy wearing it like this, it looks really cute, um, or like this, how I had it earlier. It looks really cute when you have cute earrings on. So I have these on, and I actually showed this in my What I Got For Christmas video, and I really wanted to show you guys them on, so here is what they look like. They're those leaf earrings and they're super cute. So yeah, if I'm wearing cute earrings, I will try my best to try to show them off a little bit to when I'm wearing a beanie, even if it is freezing cold outside. So let's just continue on again. Okay, so the first hairstyle, I'm going to do a more of dramatic part to the side here because I'm going to need that extra bit of hair over to the side. And once you have kind of a dramatic side part, um, what I'm basically going to do is just twist the front here and then kind of stop right here and tuck it in. So yeah, I'm going to show you right quickly how to twist the hair even though I know you guys probably know how to do that. So just basically grab two strands. They can be kind of thin and as you go down the forehead, you want to just grab a little bit of more hair. A little bit more hair and I usually like to stop when I reach like this part of my eyebrow and then I just start going back and then I still keep grabbing hair about three more times and then I'll stop and then I'll just kind of twist it just two more times grab some excess hair kind of pull it out of the way and tuck in this twist and I'm going to be using Two or three bobby pins, we'll see how it goes. So yeah, I'm gonna use three. And then just shake the hair back there. And usually, like I said, I really just like to wear my hair down when I wear beanies. But sometimes I do wanna create a little bit more interest to my hair. So this is the little twist I created. Super simple and super easy. Um, I feel like I don't really have to show you exactly step by step on how to do it, but basically what it looks like. And now I'm just going to pop my beanie on, making sure that you can see the twist. So yeah, this is the hairstyle. It has a little cute twist in the front here. Just make sure you can see it. And yeah, this is one way. I try to make it a little bit different than just putting my hair down like this. But I'm just gonna show you a close up. But yeah, this is the first hairstyle. You can make it where the twist goes a little down if it looks right for your shape of head. I just feel like for my head, it doesn't look that good. So I left it like this and have it tucked in. So when you take it off, you still have a cute little hairstyle. You might have to fluff up some things a little bit but you basically have a cute little twist in your hair and it also looks cute when you have your beanie on and it just creates a little more interest to the hair instead of having it just plain down like I showed you earlier. So this is hairstyle number one. 
this is the second one I'm doing. Um, super simple, super easy. And this one's a little bit different um, just because it will be going, I um, will be having all my hair to the side of my head. So again, we're gonna have to start with a kind of exaggerated side part and then just make sure that the other side with less hair on it is nice and slick just a little bit you don't have to like put any hairspray on it just make sure it's stuck behind your ear and i'm just going to create a fishtail but i'm not going to create it all the way down so yeah i'm just going to go ahead and get started if you want to learn how to make a fishtail braid there's thousands of videos on how to do it so i'm just going to create mine so i'm just going to speed up this process and I'll stop when, um, yeah, I'll stop it when I stop. So I'm just gonna stop right there, making sure I leave a good bit of hair left over. So yeah, this is what it looks like. It has, you know, a fishtail, and then most of it is gonna be your hair. It all depends on your hair length as well. And also, I think it'd be a really good idea to curl the ends of it just to make it look a little more fancier maybe some create some curls over here so that they're kind of falling depending on what hairstyle you have of course and um yeah i'm just gonna leave mine like this just because it's easy just to show you guys this instead of bringing in all the hot tools i'm really trying hard this year not to use that many hot tools in my hair but anyway this is what the fish tail looks like i'm going to spread it out just a little bit just kind of pull on the sides make it look a little bigger. I feel like whenever I don't look at what I'm doing, it turns out better than when I'm looking at it like this. I don't know if anyone else feels that way, but anyway. And I'm just gonna push my hair up a little bit, making sure that's slicked back. And I'm going to put my beanie on now. I just think this creates a super cute hairstyle. So you can have it, so you can, Lucy. So yeah, you can leave it like this, leaving some hair out like that. I like to just tuck mine in behind my ear and just push that up just slightly. And Lucy keeps barking over here, so if you can hear her, I am sorry. So this is how I would wear it. I just like it to be, I like there not to be hair on my face because whenever I would wear this, it would be if I'm doing some walking or if I'm like doing something sporty or if I'm wearing a scarf and I don't want my hair to get tangled, I still want it to look cute. So this is how I would wear my hair. So this is hairstyle number two. So another cute way to wear a beanie is of course wearing pigtails. I don't really like pigtails that much, but I like to loosely braid my hair into pigtail form, if that makes sense. I will show you guys. But basically, I just do a basic ponytail, grab the three strands of hair, and just loosely braid everything. Very, very loosely. Like this, like super loosely. And just braid, I mean, tie that. And then the same to the other side. And my camera's about to die, so I need to do this quickly. So loosely, about three times probably. I don't care if I leave some hair though. So yeah, very, very loosely. And then I put on my beanie. Just very loosely if I'm really trying to get my hair out of my face. So yeah, this is the last hairstyle. And again, I always like to show off my earrings <laughs> if I'm wearing some. And yeah, this is last and final hairstyles super quick and easy it took me less than a minute so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you in the next one